Center. We were picking up my mom's race packet for tomorrow. Yeah, she's running a half marathon here in Shreveport. So we went to go pick up her packet for her because she probably won't be here in time to pick it up herself. Now we're heading heading to Superior Grill, which one of my coworkers told me about. So we're going to try that out. It should be good. Testing everything out while we're still here. <laughs> I didn't vlog anything yesterday. It was kind of like just an overwhelming day and I was driving for half of it so now we're gonna eat some food and I'm excited. Yeah, so. We have plenty of time to turn. But there's construction. But you said they have good chips and salsa. Mm -hmm. Is it free? <laughs> I think so. I feel kind of weird. Very fancy. I feel like I'm oh shoot, are we underdressed? Uh -huh. oh, yeah. they look like a Okay. <laughs> a few moments later. So Blake, tell them your process of making peppers. You cook the chicken. First thing you do is go to the grocery store. Then you cook the chicken. What do you get at the grocery store? You get chicken, jalapenos, whatever type of cheese you can find. Uh, Acero works the best. Can't find anywhere around here. You got quesadilla cheese. Monterey Jack is, tastes good, but it melts all out. It's bacon. You can use pepper to regular. I like regular better. Then you cook the chicken. I like to pre-cook the bacon a little bit so it's crispy. Most people don't do that. I like to because it's easier. Today I'm actually going to cook on the grill for the first time because I haven't cooked these since Pearland? So I don't know. No, we made them the first night we were here, I think. Oh, yeah, we did, yeah. Or like one of the first nights. Yeah. Yeah, this has become a signature. And then I'll make guac, usually. I am making guac, but not right now. I'm trying to get some cool cinematic shots of Blake cooking because it looks cool. And we were just watching Julian videos, and then he's freaking hilarious and awesome, and I aspire to be like him. Oh, and Blake's mom is on her way here. She'll probably be here in a couple hours, and I probably won't vlog when she's here, just because, like, that's, I mean, I'm already awkward enough when it's just me. So, yeah. <laughs> she's running her marathon tomorrow. Half. Half marathon. My bad. Uh, I'll call this good. It's a chicken. That's about it right now. So nasty out here. What are you looking for? Mike. <laughs> Piece of cheese. Okay, I'll make the guac. Right. To make my famous guac, he's lighting the grill right now. It always terrifies me. Like, I always feel like he's gonna set the house on fire for some reason. But anyway, to make my famous guac, you need one avocado. Two avocados, not four limes. I don't know why I have four out here. Maybe two, maybe two limes. Pico, good job for not setting the house on fire. That hurts, I've never set a house on fire. 
<laughs> Garlic powder, which we're almost out of this one. Mrs. Dash salt-free Fiesta lime so that we can add our own salt because we're rebels. Chili powder, salt and pepper. Oh, I didn't remember that I marked these on the bottom. <laughs> Making guac and not money. I mean, actual guacamole. <laughs> you know what you know. Yeah. How's it going out here? Ah, pretty good. A little easier in an oven. Mm. But it's working. The bacon looks good. Mm. Come on, all right. Okay, so I'm like editing inside and Blake is being weird and just sitting outside in his car because he's bored. Mm -hmm. And your eyes look really freaking green right now no <laughs> in this camera. But anyway, I'm editing and the last clip I have is the peppers are in the grill and we didn't even, excuse me, I'm trying to talk here. The, we didn't even say anything if the peppers were good or anything. So they give us your review. Well, surprisingly, considering I've never used that type of cheese. Bacon was kind of falling apart. I cooked in the cast iron on the grill instead of baking in the oven. But overall, they actually came out pretty well. I was yeah. actually kind of surprised. They tasted pretty good. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Back to the last clip, which is us watching the Astros game. And then that's the end of the vlog. So. Sweet. Mm-hmm. <laughs>